Hi everyone, welcome. Thanks so much for stopping in. I'm Rena, and in today's Boxes and Deals, I have my Puzzle Culture box. This is a seasonal box, and I actually didn't get the winter box, so it's been a little bit since I've shown it. My last box I showed was fall. I did show the first one back in um, last year's summer box. Um, that was the vinyl records one, the vinyl, vinyl love, something like that. And then the fall one was the skeleton one. Loved that. The skull, skull, I wish I could remember the names of these, the skull themed one. And, um, I didn't get the winter because that was when we were moving and I'll, I missed a lot of boxes that got lost in the mail a lot of things happened. <laughs> um, that's when I became frustrated with U.S. Postal Service. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Still am. Still dealing with some of that. I, still getting things sent to my old address and they're not getting forwarded even though they confirmed that it should be. So my recommendation is if you move, just stop all your subscriptions well beforehand. <laughs> I didn't want to do that, but anyway, so puzzle culture, this is the spring 2020, 2021 box. And I think it is B themed. So I did see some sneak peeks, but I have not opened it yet. Um, I also did get some of the pricing down as far as value. This box is $34.99 per quarter. Uh, plus ten dollars shipping in the US. They do ship I believe they ship I think you would have to write to her to see where they ship to or they may have a list on their website. I um but the fee would be a lot more of course. Um but it is ten dollars flat rate in the US and thirty to four ninety nine per quarter. So that's forty five dollars basically per quarter. Um, if you do an annual subscription, so that's four boxes a year, you would save some money. It would be $31.25 per box plus the $10 shipping. Um, and with the annual box, you would get occasional bonuses in your boxes. All right. The awesome thing about this box, it is Latina owned. She is, um, Dawn is the owner. She is an avid puzzle lover. She is, um, a sub subscription box fanatic like me and she loves the nerd geek culture so she put all of those together and created this box which I think is a lot of fun and I love how each one is themed each one has its own exclusive artwork that she incorporates into her puzzles and then she surrounds that it's a 1000 piece puzzle each quarter each box and then she get, adds in three to five gift items that go along with that theme. So I think it is an amazing box. It is gender, gender neutral, age neutral. It's for anybody. So just a lot of fun, a great idea for families, um, for anybody. All right. So when I open the box, it looks like this. We'll show the puzzle last. So first we get a reusable silicone straw, dishwasher safe and sustainable by Go Silly. And I'm guessing spice is the color that we received. So it's in a little reusable tin, which is awesome. Great for on the go. You can stick it in your purse or your pocket <laughs> and not ask for a plastic straw. You have your own silicone reusable straw. Wrap it back up in the tin, get home and wash it. And I believe this is valued at $3.50. The You can purchase past subscriptions. So um, like I mentioned, the summer box was the vinyl and the fall box was the school themed one. You can still purchase those in their shop. I did not see the winter one, so they may have sold out of that one. Um, in fact, I know they did because that's why I didn't, I wasn't able to get a replacement because they didn't have any more. Um, Someone got lost in the mail and 
who knows where it's at now. <laughs> anyway, so I didn't get that one, but they also have past kids boxes. So they do have a children's subscription. Uh, I need to check more details on that. It, it might not be a subscription. It might be an occasional kids um, puzzle box. I'll look at more details. And then um, they also have the individual past puzzles that you can buy if you don't want the whole box. And those are $22. All right, now I got it open. So yes, I think the color is spice. So that's fun. Very summery. Of course, you just pop it out. I mean, obvious, but <laughs> pop it out and there you go. There you go. Use it, stick it back in. That'll be harder than popping it out. Get home and wash it and you're good. Just remember to get home and wash it and not leave it in your purse. <laughs> That's, that would be me. All right, then we get a tissue pack. Those are adorable. This is great for travel too. And that's bee themed. This is by Made With Love in Germany. Ideal Home Range is the company. This is $1.50 value. All right, then we get a packet of bee food, wildflower seed packet, a pollinator packet, they call it. This is valued at $3.50. This is by Sister Bees. And it gives you all the tips on planting. We have plenty of bees around our house. All right. And last, I'm excited about this. This is reusable beeswax food wraps. I have been wanting to try these for a while now. I'm surprised they haven't come in one of my subscriptions yet, but... Somehow they haven't, and now I get to try it, and it tells about how to use. Um, this is by this does not have a brand name on it. It does say made in China, but the most of the three pack. This is a three pack. I'm pretty sure. It doesn't say again on the box, but um, ones I found online for three packs were generally around $20, even on Amazon. So that's about a $20 value here. So there's three sizes, and they are tacky so it will stick well to any surface or I've seen Gail from That Canadian Girl Unboxes. I was watching her video and she uses them to wrap her cheese just directly around it and she said it saves the cheese, it makes it last longer than anything else they've ever tried. So it is very sticky but you would just mold it around whatever you're wrapping let your, the heat of your hand kind of mold it and it will stay put and keep everything fresh. And then you just wash it with safe um, natural soap and reuse it. So very sustainable and eco-friendly. I do appreciate that. So that's fun. It does have a little bit of a sticky residue. All right, and then... Each box will come with a challenge card, a prompt, um, with which you can um, use to as a different way, as a challenging way to do your puzzle, uh, to put your puzzle together. This, call, this Be Kind puzzle challenge is color story, yellow flowers first, purple flowers second, greenery last. How much of the king bee can you complete without mixing in the purple flowers? mixing in with the purple flowers. And then you can post your puzzles using the hashtags. And then here's the content card, three sheets of the food wraps, the bee food from Sisters Bees, the Boston International Save the Bees print tissue pack, and the silicone reusable straw from Go Silly. And the thousand piece puzzle is by 
is called Bee King. And the artwork this month, this season, is by Marie Corona. Let's see if it's on there anywhere. Yes, right here. But here's the picture. So um, let me unwrap it so, you, so that you're not getting the glare. So you'll have the picture on the front, but you'll have the full picture on the back, which is nice. 1,000 pieces. So let me show you the back. And there's the B. So that's our 1,000 piece puzzle. The nice thing about these pieces is they st stay together very well. So even if you put them in a puzzle rule, they should stay put um, without breakage, which I appreciate. So these are good quality puzzles. Again, the value per puzzle is $22 by itself. So I estimated the total value for this box to be about what I think about $50 yes right about $50 and we paid um if you were to pay full price I believe I feel like I have a, a discount too I'll look that up and put that up there um so we paid 45 with shipping so I will say if you're looking for value more um if you're looking for a subscription a puzzle subscription that saves you 50 percent or something that won't be the case with this one you'll save a little bit of money but it's more about the theming exclusivity you're not going to find these puzzles anywhere else um these are exclusive artwork to this box um and then the theming and just all these different bonus gifts um that you get with each box. So it's just a lot of fun. I think it would make an amazing gift to any family or anybody who likes puzzles um, and things like that. All right. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Are you a puzzle lover? Let me know in the comments and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.